I'm standing right in front of the police headquarters known as News Edit House here in Abuja where a bomb explosion exploded a few minutes ago. The car conveying the bomb was actually following after the convoy of the Inspector General of Police. When he got to the gate here, he was asked that he could not park where he wanted to park and asked to go park in the parking space. It was while turning around that the explosion took place. The man died instantly and the car burned beyond recognition. Well, we are all aware of the unfortunate incident that occurred at the first quarter this morning. And the Inspector General of Police has expressed his displeasure over the suicide bomb attack on vehicles at the first headquarters Abuja car park. The unfortunate incident which led to the death of the suicide bomber and a police traffic warning occurred at about 11.00 hours when the suicide bomber vehicle was intercepted and directed to the car park for searching and checking. The traffic warden who entered the vehicle of the suicide bomber to direct him to the car park was blown off along with him, that is the suicide bomber, as soon as they got to the car park. The IGP wishes to appreciate the effort of the fire servicemen, NEMA, the armed forces fire service who promptly responded to put off the fire. The body of the suicide bomber has been recovered and a full investigation has commenced. Members of the public are sure that the criminal elements behind this dastardly act will be fished out as the government, the police and other security agencies will not succumb to the demand of any criminal group or individuals. Reporting for ITR in Abuja, I am Shail Adebomi.